Tonight, videos capturing moments of chaos in the halls of this New York City public school. Students marching through Hillcrest High School in Queens, phones out recording as they dance in a circle and wave Palestinian flags. After approximately 400 students acted disruptively, roving the school and calling for the removal of a Jewish educator. The reason that teacher was targeted, this image, which circulated on social media in the days prior, allegedly showing her at a rally supporting Israel. The teacher at Hillcrest High School was targeted based on her support for Israel. Expressed in a permissible way outside of school hours and her Jewish identity. The NYPD says they received a call from a 45-year-old woman saying she received a threat from an unknown person at the school on social media and were able to disperse the crowd without incident. New York City Mayor Eric Adams calling the video of the protest a, quote, vile show of anti-Semitism motivated by ignorance-fueled hatred Plain and simple. A couple of days later, the school receiving another warning from a student that more protests were planned unless the teacher was removed. The school was able to, de to deploy school safety agents and put the school under lockdown. The chancellor of New York City Public Schools insisting the situation at the Queens High School is under control and the teacher was never in direct danger. I think a lot of what has happened here has been overblown. This sense that the kids here are being cast as a bunch of anti-Semites throughout the school. There are 2,500 kids that go to this school. Uh, that's overblown for sure. Other city officials not convinced. City Councilwoman Vicki Palladino is calling for the school to be shut down pending a full investigation. Where is the principal of Hillcrest High School? I want an audit done. Palladino releasing this cell phone video of a separate, unrelated incident at the very same school just days earlier. A fight between three students erupting into an all-out brawl. Students seen beating a uniformed security officer as his colleague tried to pull them away. The NYPD says four students were taken into custody and issued juvenile reports, and three school safety agents were injured. For its part, Hillcrest High School says it's conducting a full investigation and working to educate students on why their behavior is unacceptable. We could not simply allow this entire school body to be demonized. We have to be careful in the way we talk about our children as well. The chancellor said this incident happened while students were changing classes and many did not know what they were participating in. Due to privacy and confidentiality rules, the school cannot comment on disciplinary actions for individual students. But the chancellor said just a short while ago, some students have been suspended. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.